morning. Welcome to the Gun Circus, and uh, we are working legs today, and uh, we're going to do three power movements starting off, and uh, then we're uh, after I demonstrate it for you guys, we're going to break and uh, get to it, finish it up ourselves, and then we'll come back and uh, we'll show you some uh, butt work and uh, some calf work, which uh, we commonly do on leg day. And uh, a lot of times we'll only do uh, one power movement. Uh, today we're doing three. We're gonna do squats, front squats, and sissy squats. We're doing sissy squats on the hack machine, on the, uh, on the uh, uh, hack squat machine. So um, I'm gonna walk you through these. Uh, I'm not gonna demonstrate squat for you. Uh, well, I probably will, just simply because it's, everybody knows how to do squats. But uh, I'm gonna start you off here just to show you what the squat, front squat looks like. Then we'll move over here to the hack squat machine for the sissy squats, and then on over to the regular squat. Front squats, we want to keep the weight in front of our body, that's why it's called front squat. So instead of setting it on your shoulders, you're going to rest it on the front part of your shoulders. So you take the weight off like this, feet shoulder width apart. This is performed a little bit differently than what we're accustomed to. You're going to pull your feet down. I've always taught you before to have them up. Pull them down. Pull your butt off the pad and put the impact on the knees. Probably good for jumping. Don't recommend a great deal of weight on that <clears throat> because it pushes so hard on your knees. Just concentrate on good form, controllable weights, completing the movement. Let's go look at squats real quick. Straight down. Don't lean forward or back. All right. So that's it for the power movements. We're going to break here, run ourselves through this routine, and we'll be back in a bit. <clears throat> 